That is why we are getting these delays. But eventually, Mr. President will soon be here. We were told that Mr. President insisted on consensus all through. And if he's insisted on consensus, and some people are saying that we have to go for the ballot, why don't you think people should test their popularity through the ballot? Well, consensus is part of our democracy. And uh, even according to the electoral law, consensus is one of the issues that we can adopt uh, in democracy. But as we said, in case we have not succeeded in making candidates to withdraw for a particular candidate, then we go for election. And we are ready for the election. If all the positions are to go on election, we are ready for the election. Don't you think this last lack of consensus is a really a threat to your party ahead of the presidential primaries? Well, you know, as I told you, democracy, I mean, uh, consensus is a part of democracy, and consensus is a very peaceful way of uh, running election in, a pol in political parties. But for the presidential candidate, if we reach there, we know what to do. But all the delegates, they are set now. Are Over 7,000 delegates, they've been here since 8 o'clock in the morning. Yes. Yet, this program has not started. But you see that they are all happy. Because they are here because they are committed. They are here because they are interested. And they are here because they believe in the party. And we have to thank Mr. President for putting a lot of efforts to unite the party. The party is united. That is why you see people are patiently waiting despite that there are delays, but these delays are as a result of we want precision in the conduct. We want precision in the conduct of the election. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you. The Executive Governor of Kano State, Governor Abdullahi Gandoje there, and um, he's talking about Mr. President doing everything he can do to make sure they reach consensus for here. The program is running late. I told you that earlier that you have over 7,000 delegates. They are all here. Thank you so much, Your Excellency. The 7,000 delegates, they are here, they are waiting, they are waiting. Now, let me tell you that the principal officers, the major players, the major actors, that all the delegates, they are here, but the actors are not here. Apologies for that. We, we lost, we lost, uh, well, we just had a live, just had a live interview with Ayodilo Zubaku, live for us from the convention ground in Abuja of the... And I hear, I gather that, especially in the southwest, it's very difficult for them to reach a consensus on who becomes the general secretary of the party in the southwest through that unity list. Now, that's out in the southwest, in the unity list, what was allotted to the southwest is the national vice chairman and the secretary and the national youth leader. But they are having problem in putting it together through the unity list of Mr. President. And I can tell you that earlier today, I spotted a document signed by the former Benway State Governor, that Senator George Ackerman, saying that on behalf of the six other aspirants that they decided to come together and support the former Governor of Niger State, that's Governor Abdullah Adamu, for the position of the, um, the position of the national chairman. And I told you earlier that, look, for that to happen, the new electoral act is saying that those aspirants must come together and they must give a signing, some sign undertaking and saying it and even coming here to affirm the fact that they decided to step down for Governor Abdullahi Adamu, that's the former governor of Niger State. And that has happened. So we are saying that the chairmanship position might have been sorted but what we're looking at here is other positions and for they if they want to have that unity list all the names of all the positions and members of the national working community they will have to unanimously agree on just a single name and they will come here and a vote on yes or no will be passed and it will be ratified so unanimously everybody here they will form a quorum to actually accept that list but if that does not happen today i'm afraid that all the 36 states 7,000 delegates that we have to go through the grueling process of balloting and after the man have exercised the franchise across the six states do we have to start sorting it and when they sort it they'll start counting it and at the end of the day this might take us till the early hours of sunday